Hello, my name's Karen Burke. I'm a Gestalt psychotherapist. I am a trainer and a supervisor. Uh, my private practice is at the Manchester Institute for Psychotherapy and I'm here today with Bob Cook. Hello. Hi there, Bob, uh, who is the founder and the clinical director of the Institute. And um, on the first Friday of every month, uh, there is a two-hour seminar that is given by um, generally experienced yeah. practitioners, not necessarily psychotherapists, because no. we've had all sorts of people yeah. come in on yeah. all sorts of interesting subjects. That's true. And uh, these seminars um, run for two hours on the first Friday of every month, right. and uh, I'd like to talk to Bob about that today. Oh, well, thank you for giving me that opportunity. We started these seminars in 1989. Gosh, that's a long time ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have we not run out of topics yet, Bob? Yeah, I was thinking we run out of topics. Uh, and they ran for many years until, I think, something like 1998. Right. And then the first host of them, I think, was Tom Byrne. Um, decided to step down after 11 years or something. Right. And then we had a gap, I yeah. think, till 2003, and then we, somebody else came and hosted for about four or five years, and mm. she had to step down. We had another gap, and we just started up again in the last couple of years. Mm. Um, so really they've been going, a majority of the time that we've mm. been going. Um, so that uh, people always ask for them again. So if there's a gap, mm. people are always texting or phoning mm. or emailing and saying, when are you going to start these seminars again yeah. and what's the next one? So they've become very popular. Okay. They're open okay. to the public alike. Yes. Um, and you are, a lot of people in the mental health professions, of course, mm. to come to them because the subjects are very much on um, the caring world and psychotherapy, counselling, uh, mental health mm. issues um, so it attracts people yeah. from that area and specifically therapists, counsellors, probation mm. workers, social workers, nurses but also people who are just interested. Now we get an average of probably 10 to 12, 14 people most um, of those seminars, there's been less of course and there's been a lot more I mm. mean I remember doing one on shame mm. um, when that was the last, probably a couple of years ago, and there was 30 odd people in the room, wow. and that was for people sitting down, standing up, and goodness mm. knows what. Yeah. But on average, yeah. I think you would find 10, 12, 14. Mm. Um, so the next one, for example, which is tomorrow, yeah. is that right? Tomorrow, is yeah, yeah. tomorrow, yeah, is my wife Stephanie Cook talking about uh, the interface between neurobiology and um, psychotherapy. Mm. In other words, the latest information on research, brain research, yes. and how that has its implications in the psychotherapeutic process. Now, I know there's probably going to be about 20 to that one. Mm. Yeah. Um, so it, it becomes a full house, and um, I mean, on some of the more minor topics, or perhaps more obscure topics, mm. we might get, as I say, eight and nine people. Yeah. Um, and people come along, yeah. 6.30, I would appeal for people to come early because seats are often taken. Yes. And if you pay on the day, it's just £10, we've kept it very low really. Yeah. That's just for uh, per the person who's doing the presentations, petrol costs or whatever. Mm. Um, and uh, we don't have a booking system, so you just no. come along. And they're always at the Institute. But it's become a very... Um, important part of the institute in many ways yeah. because it's such a consistent yeah. uh, structure we've got. Hmm. And you've been to, wow, you've been to loads. You've been here nine years, so you must have been to many, many, many of them. I have. I know you've run a few. I have. I've, r I've run many. I've te and attended even more. You've yes. run on, th if I can think about it, you've run on and gone to Stolt. Yes. Oh, attachment, bereavement, most of the areas I can yeah. think about. Genograms. Oh yeah, that was your last one on That's genograms. That's right, I did it on genograms. Yeah, uh, yeah. I've uh, done them on um, uh, ethical practice. Mm -hmm. 
uh, record keeping. Oh, yeah. So, you know, I, I've done both sort of oh. subjects and also some quite specific. Yeah, yeah. That's when we get a bit less in number, probably. Yes. Yeah. Um, but, you know, if we talk of the ones coming up, mm. uh, I did one last month, month, month on psychodynamic theory, object relations, and it was called Don't Shoot the Messenger. Yes. Um, the next one, which I think will be very popular, is tomorrow, which yeah. is the latest on brain research. The one in November, because it's always the first Friday in November, is me. Yeah. And I'm talking about vulnerable self in psychotherapy. And really, I'm going to talk about the shame-based system. Yeah. Um, the one after that is an interesting. We've got a hypnotherapist coming in. Oh, yeah. Talking about how we can use hypnotherapy in the psychotherapeutic process. Mm. You're doing one in February? I'm doing the first week. That's right. I'm uh, providing the seminar on... Uh, bipolar disorder. Bipolar disorder I'm doing it on, yes. Yeah, what yes. we used to call manic depression years ago. That's right, yes, <laughs> yeah. yes. And we've got some interesting people that are lined up as well in various uh, areas. So this is to really as an advert for the seminars so you know a little bit about what happens in them. Uh, please feel free to come along. The more the merrier. Mm. Um, and thank you for listening. And thank you for talking to me about the seminars and uh, giving me the opportunity to think back in history. Yeah. You're welcome, Bob. Thank you. Thanks very much. Bye-bye. Bye for now. And bye-bye to you.